Week four, baby. It's our restaurant road trip. Big Jim's house, Big Jim. Ryan's got the camera. We are here. London Fish and Chips, London, England. I'm Dan Cortez, MTV Sports. No, is that too much? I can't do that one again. <laughs> We're gonna get some fish and chips. Ryan, chips are French fries. I know. Yeah. All right, we got our mask, but we're inside actually eating. It is week four of a restaurant road trip here at Big Jim's house here, and we are at London Fish and Chips right here. We are in Clinton Township, 34380 Harper, south of 15 Mile. Bill back there working hard, just telling us uh, this May, May will be 20 years, right? Yeah. May will be 20 years here, and uh, so we had to get the fish and chips. Okay, first and foremost, see that? Watch this. See the break? Oh yeah. Right? See it? Okay, don't do that. That looks creepy when you're doing it that way. <laughs> you really want to eat it? <laughs> See that fish? He was telling us his cod. This is this is the gold standard. If you're into fish and chips, this is legit. Did you try some yet? Not yet. I'm not whole showing the other piece because I've already been eating on that while I was waiting on you to set up the camera. Go ahead, take it right. off. It's hot. Get in there. Get it. Right? Mm. Here's the thing. They're so flaky. The crust on the outside, and then when you bite into it, that flakiness. Yeah. There's tartar sauce That's here. That's what does it. I don't know why you'd ever use it. You don't need it. It's sacrilege. That's putting ketchup on a coney, kind of. This is legit. The batter, look. I can get one of the tails. Sometimes you get fish and chips and you get batter and that's all you taste is batter. Yes. You know what I mean? Or the oil yeah. from, from the fry, but none of that. Yeah. Absolutely. Bill doesn't mess around here, man. Some of the coleslaw as well. That's important. I love coleslaw. Throw the coleslaw. Really? Oh, and you see what I like about it? Got a little bit more of the vinegar to it, too. We didn't even try vinegar on our fish and chip chef. Oh, we'll probably good. do that. So this is an example to me of a place that's just part of the community. We talk about this all the time. And by the way, thanks to our friends E.W. Smith and also Auto Owners Insurance Group. I got it right. I got it right. Okay, you got cool. it right. Uh, Bob and everybody there, man, they're fantastic. And they're part of this as well. What we did was uh, the tip on behalf of them and on behalf of you CSX listeners, 50 bucks. We're going to do that for everyone. That's the least we can do. Bill's, excuse me, Bill's awesome. This is great fish, dude. This is it. great. I got to do it since everybody was making fun of me. For what? Well, one, not knowing that chips or fries and okay. for liking tartar sauce so much. But You're going to put tartar sauce on there? Got to. Now these are chips. <laughs> you know that now, right? <laughs> if you don't know for the longest time, Ryan was convinced that chips were potato chips and he would ask for fries instead of chips at a yeah. fish and chips place. American. American. Right off 15, <laughs> we, it's right off 15 mile. I mean, literally what, how, two minutes? Two minutes and Off yeah. the freeway, boom. Turn left, boom. You're there, easy to get to. Wow, London fish and chips. I don't know. Works what everybody talking about, man. But that good. And when you get it, get it here or eat it in the car. Or go for it. You know, I could go for him. Yeah. Makes sense. I think so. Subtitles here, maybe. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> All right. There you go. Someone else come here. How are you doing? Yeah. London Fish and Chips, man. Two thumbs away up. 20 years in May, man. There's a reason they're here. Stop on by and say hi to Bill. And he didn't try to hit you or anything. No, that's good. You're good? Yeah. Okay. I had to order, though. <laughs> 